DIY with Chris, giving you the tools to do it yourself. Hi, I'm Chris, and we're going to do a short video review on the Fiskars Push Lawnmower. Today we have the Fiskars Push Lawnmower. It's a manual push lawnmower, and we purchased ours at the Military Exchange Store. Uh, you can also find this on Amazon though if you don't have access to that and it's priced at around $190. This push lawnmower was very easy to put together, had great instructions on it. Um, your pivot handle point just has two bolts right down here with, with some uh, wing nuts on them so you can keep them from sliding off and it does have multiple holes that you can put it in here to adjust the height of the person that is mowing the lawn. Um, when, you're, when you don't have it in use you can just slide it forward and it, so it stores a whole lot better with that straight up storage option. Um, as you're pushing this lawnmower, this push lawnmower, it does propel your, bl your blades so it does have an advanced real device stay sharp cutting systems the blades are supposed to stay sharp a whole lot longer than other push lawn mowers it does have an inset wheel design for edging as you'll see right here on the left hand side the front wheels are set on the inside as well as the rear wheels so the only thing that you're not cutting is this very small piece right here on the left so you can do some really good edging on your left side. The right side has some other adjusting equipment, so not on that side, but here on this side, it does a great job, job with edging. It has a protection bar right here in the front with the handles, so it'll help you move it if you need to, lift it up and whatnot. We do have the height adjustment on the right side here, and it goes from one inch to four inches. It has an inertial drive system for easy pushing or for easier pushing than other push lawnmowers. Um, the problems that I've had with this is it does say that it has a stay sharp blade system. However, I've had some problems with these being fairly dull. It also says that with the inertia drive system propelling the blades that it can cut through thicker grass um, like the southern grasses like we have here in Texas, the Bermuda. Um, we've still had, uh, we cut our Bermuda grass and it does a fairly good job, but so a lot of the time it'll grab up a good chunk of it because it's very viney and it'll clog up the mower and it just won't cut it very well. So that in addition to the fact that the blades have been doling out is a definitely con for this as compared to a regular uh, gas lawnmower. Other than that, this has been a really great push lawnmower. We got this before we got our gas lawnmower just to save a little bit of money. And this is definitely an excellent punishment tool for your children if they get in some trouble. So go ahead and pick one of these up and then when they mess up, just have them mow the lawn on the weekend with one of these. If you got a full acre, it's going to take them quite a while and give them a really good workout. Uh, not too bad a punishment there. So if you have any questions on it, please let me know and I'll be glad to answer them. Thank you. Have a good day.